Hi, in this video I will show how to create KMZ file from Excel. You can see on my computer I have an Excel file open. It contains uh, uh, time and latitude, longitude, elevation coordinates into... Uh, there are like different columns, but we will just ignore them for this. Um, it's just for demonstration purposes. But a uh, most important for, uh, columns to create KMZ track is uh, time and GPS data. So it's latitude, longitude, elevation. I'll be using this file to create KMZ and uh, I will download application from this website. I will link on the site on description. Uh, to find app, I click on search and type on KMZ oh, Excel, create KMZ file. Yeah, this one. I need this one. And then um, Excel to KMZ, click on download and wait, uh, wait until uh, archive will be downloaded to my computer. KMZ is capable to store uh, different types of GPS data, including polygons, points of interest, and tracks. Uh, in this video, we will create only tracks, KMZ. Uh, if you, if you want to see, uh, like, I will be recording more videos on, on conversions, KMZ files, and so if you're interested, please consider subscribing to my channel. You can see archive has been downloaded. I'll click on downloaded archive, double click on the assigned site archive and click more info here. I'm getting the screen from Windows because I'm not registered publisher with Microsoft, if it's a publisher unknown. So I'll just click on the way to start installation, click on next, next install, click on yes, and click on finish and final screen. And you can see application has been installed on my computer. I have a new shortcut on my desktop. Now I can close this, this and double click on shortcut to launch the app. Now, if you would like to see, uh, to have a file I showed you before, um, uh, it's demo file, you can click on download this link and it will be downloaded to your computer. So um, then, uh, as I said, conversion is three steps. So step one, we will select input Excel file. I'll click to uh, my files. It's, I know it's in documents, it's called my track two, so I'll just open it, click on next step. And here we have to, first, if uh, our Excel file contains header and my does, so I will keep it checked because first row is column names. And here on the second step, I have to map uh, um, latitude, latitude, altitude, and time column to what I have in Excel. Now, your Excel file may be different. You may have a different column, different column names, but it doesn't matter because on step two, we're matching can the um, track columns to our Excel data. So it's it's very easy. I just go and select latitude, uh, longitude, uh, altitude is elevation, and time, time is time. That's it. And click on next step and final step and just click run to create KMZ file. I call it, let's call it Excel to KMZ. Yeah. And just click save to save the file. Now I can go to my maps Google. My maps Google. Okay, uh, let's delete this. It's just uh, testing map I done before. So now let's go and import our file. Select just to make sure that everything has been converted correctly. And you can see it's it's converted correctly. All my track. Um, data is here showing me beginning and end of uh, of my um, track. Yeah, everything is perfect. So uh, we have converted our Excel file to KMZ. If you have any problems with converting or uh, any questions, please uh, uh, leave them in comments below. Thank you.